Boy, isn't that just a pickle? Be a fly behind the scenes as we work through the summer stitch along where I noticed something was kind of weird. It's technically right, but it would totally throw me off. What do you think? No wrong answers today. Hi, I'm Mikey from The Crochet Crowd and thank you so much for joining our channel today. I'm here to inspire you and create magic with your crochet hook. Are you ready to play? Oh yeah, that sounds good. So we had a really interesting debate yesterday uh, behind the scenes about the study of ombre in week number five. And I'm doing week number five and I'm looking at it and I, and I invented, I believe, a stitch. And I was looking at it, I'm like, I don't remember doing a front post treble I remember it being a, a back post treble. And I go and I, and I like, I, I am sure. So I go and look at the instructions and clearly it says um, back post treble. And I'm like, what? Why is the diagram saying it's a front post treble? So I'm like, huh. And then I'm realizing that I'm like, okay, well, maybe I'm just getting it wrong in my head. And so I'm following it, and because the blanket has to be turned to the back side, the wrong side to do this thing, is that technically, when the stitch would be done, the back post treble would actually be on the front post if you're looking at the front of the project. So I'm like, okay, well, maybe that makes sense, but uh, for myself being a crochet person that likes crochet diagrams, if I didn't know that that's what was happening in this particular diagram, I would totally do the stitches on the wrong side of the project. So I was thinking, oh, hmm, am I wrong? Am I wrong? So anyway, I contacted my uh, mentor for design, Svetlana, and I'm like, I, I think that I'm misunderstanding this. And it turns out that there was a debate behind the scenes about what should be shown as the front side and the wrong side or the front or the back of the project when it comes to crochet diagrams. So I feel like it's an episode of Wacky Tuesday, you know, front equals back, back equals front. So if a crocheter did not realize that the crochet diagram was saying that this is what the front of the project looks like and the crochet crochet was to follow it around, they would actually do the stitches incorrectly because we have labeled the it as a front post treble when the, when the instructions say it's a back post treble. I don't think we can allow that to happen, so... Um, so talked quickly uh, with my mentor and I'm like, you know, if it were me and I always um, promote these crochet diagrams and I don't look at the words, I would accidentally put the texture on the wrong side. So anyway, we came to the discussion whether a crochet diagram always should be showing the, the right side up, the front, uh, the good side facing up and the back side towards the back. So even though the project got flipped over, the instructions for the crocheter has to mentally say, okay, back equals front, front equals back, and actually transpose that in their mind. I'm like, honey, have you seen my mind work? <laughs> You're lucky I can complete a sentence. <laughs> so anyway, I'm like, oh my God, I think we're gonna set these people up for failure. So now it could just be me because it's my design, but I requested that the pattern be reflipped on there and turn it around so that the crocheter, if they don't ever look at the, the written words, they could literally continue to crochet and not screw up their pattern. So uh, we actually got that to be flipped, uh, which is great for me because I think it's gonna be a lot of a, of a, a problem solver in the future. But I was thinking, um, what is the right way um, in a crochet diagram? Even though the blanket gets turned front to back, should the diagram always, all the way through, always show the front side of the project? Or should there be allowances to be able to flip the diagram when it's more convenient for the crocheter to learn? So that is a really interesting pickle. I'm not actually sure what the right answer is to that. Maybe you have some comments to that. But I just feel like if you don't, like one thing I like about crochet diagrams, I know some of you hate them, like loathe them, because um, you let me know that. But the fact is, is that I don't need to know English um, to use these diagrams. And because the crochet crowd is so global, I felt like once this gets into the world, I feel like people are going to be screwing up that element of the of the project by allowing them to believe what they're seeing is actually reality. So it's technically right. It's what the front of the blanket looks like. But if a crochet did not know to flip the blanket, um, in that particular process, all of the fun texture would be on the back. So let me know what you think. Um, no wrong answers today.
<laughs> um, really interesting debate. Who would have thought you have to think about all this crap with crochet? <laughs> um, but yeah, I've, my mind's just spinning today. Hopefully yours is better.